Amputation of the lower extremities include amputation of digits, partial foot amputation, ankle disarticulation, below knee amputations, knee bearing amputations, above knee amputations, and hip disarticulations. Amputations of the upper extremities include amputation of digits, metacarpal amputations, wrist disarticulations, forearm amputation, elbow disarticulation, above elbow amputation, and shoulder disarticulation. Show you here is a person that is a below the entity. The reason I know that is here because there's room for them to put in their stump or their residual limb as it's known, put it in there and then be able to bend it. And they can't do anything with that there, so the knee is just here, okay? In this particular case, it's for a man. And what happens is the way this person puts it on, everybody has to have a sleeve or a sock or something covering their residual limb. A person has got their leg off right up here. It locks itself into place and when you walk on, on an artificial leg, you, you put the heel down, you come across to the top and you go to the other side. Once you get to the toe, and I can't do it, then the leg will bend. You have to be very, very careful to learn how to go heel, toe, to go over the top and get that motion because if you don't, it just locks on you and you fall flat down. Computer control, it's not working obviously now, this is an old one, the battery is inside here and they haven't connected it. But when it works, it is the most incredible thing because it's all done by impulses from the individual. They have to learn how to make that work by the impulses, by them themselves making it work. They have to say, I want to open my hand, I want to close my hand. And by those impulses, these fingers all move independently. Most of us, we are allowed to have one new leg every two years, covered by our early health care. And if the new leg is uh, suitable and working fine and the old leg can't be worn on a regular basis anymore, then sometimes some of us are able to have that second leg made as a spare leg. The other MPT Sport and Recreation Association is commonly known as ASRA. ASRA was started about 30 years ago by a group of amputees that wanted to go skiing with the aim that they would be able to get funding from the government. 
This later progressed into other sporting events, including a provincial track and field event for amputees. Today, Azra has over 200 members that partake in various different sporting activities. Azra today offers friendship, the opportunity to meet with other amputees and discuss difficulties they face, and the opportunity to incorporate sport into, into individuals' rehabilitation process. In lights. He just wants to be heard, whether it's the beat of the mic He feels so unlike everybody else alone In spite of the fact that some people still think that they know him But fuck him, he knows the code It's not about the salary, it's all about reality And making some noise, making a story Making sure his click stays up That means when he puts it down, Tots picking it up Let's go Who the hell is he anyway? He never really talks much Never concerned with status, but still even him starstruck Humble through opportunities, given despite the fact That many misjudged Cause he makes a living from writing raps Put it together himself Got a picture connects Never asking for someone's help But to get some respect He's only focused on what he wrote His will is beyond reach And now it all unfolds The skill of an artist This is 20% skill 80% fear Be a hundred